That special and unbeatable feeling of match day is in the air. And the knowledge that this has all the makings of a vibrant and compelling encounter. Anticipation levels are sky high. And every expectation that this game will live up to its considerable billing. This confrontation is live coming up on EA TV. It's a great privilege to be here on the South Coast, in particular at Fratton Park. My name's Derek Ray, and delighted to have alongside me, as usual on these occasions, Stuart Robson. And live action coming up from the Carabao Cup. It's Portsmouth up against Watford. Well, there's nothing like a good cup run to boost confidence, and these two teams will be hoping this could be their year to win this tournament. Yes, there's a long way to go, but this is still a big game for both teams. And this is the starting 11 for Portsmouth. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. Good piece of closing down. The high press was on and that's a fantastic tackle. And he's in. And a goal right off the bat. No wonder they're jumping for joy. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. Well, back underway and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Kone, strong but fair tackle. Well, the referee allowing the play to flow. Gakia, Ismail Kone, and scope for them to produce something exciting, but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Now here's Camara. Is it going to be? It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Well, as you can see, this is absolutely brilliant. He's such a good runner with the ball, and it's a great individual goal. Brilliant from him. So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0. Aspria. What a brilliant pass. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. And back with Camara. Real chance. Couldn't quite hang on. Oh, and he puts away the second chance. But the goalkeeper angry with himself here. Well, here it is again, and I don't think it's good enough from the goalkeeper, you have to say that. He spilled it right into the danger zone, and at this level, you're always going to be punished. This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3-0. Porteous. Well, nicely cut out.
He continues his run. Oh, it might be. Well, he didn't miss by an awful lot. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Aspria. Joe Rafferty. Rewarded for that brilliant high press. But after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Lewis. Emmanuel Dennis. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Well, can they be creative from here? In with a chance! And you cannot argue with a hat-trick. Simply unstoppable today. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, but there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plum. It's a great goal. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. Aspria. He continues his run. And played in. Opportunity missed. And Watford have it back now. Good run, very much in control of the situation. Keeper getting the touch. And eventually, goalkeeper's ball. Well, you can sense the relief amongst his teammates, but what a first save that was. And that's very good refereeing to let the play flow. And showing fine vision. Well, the flag was up in good time, bringing that move to an end. Well, he's just got to be more patient there. He's gone too early. Stoppage in play and a chance for the referee to go back and retrospectively hand out a yellow card. Here it is now, a substitution. Hoot. Kone. Gakia. Aspria. Oh, great block. And possession lost by Portsmouth. Illegal play, and hence a free kick. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Porteous. The well, the electronic board showing three additional minutes. Good technique displayed. Rafferty 
That's a useful cross. Uh, the cross was deep, a little too deep. Emmanuel Dennis. And the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at Fratton Park. And we're focusing on him for a reason, Stuart. He's asking plenty of questions of the defenders. Well, he's looked unstoppable today. Quick, clever, skillful, and he's taken his goals really well. He's been wonderful to watch. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Morel. Can he find the net? Oh, did so well to deny him. Well, using the space really well, you've got to say. Hoot. And it's Dennis. And a strong tackle. He's enjoying space. Crossing into the middle. Well, they couldn't make anything of that cross with the ball in a decent enough position. Connor Ogilvy fed over towards the back post well when you thrive on crosses you look to put them away well having got to that cross he just can't get above it can he Portsmouth doing well to regain possession. Tom Lowry. Oh, managing to beat him. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Clearance needed to be better. No real challenge for the goalkeeper. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Portsmouth a little wasteful in possession. Connor Ogilvy. That's a good looking shot. Well, a powerful effort, but just wide. Aspria. And he was in the right place to intercept. Oh, what a top notch pass. Well, not away properly. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. And a really good diving stop. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And cleared away. Now counter-attacking possibilities. 
Well, they need to get bodies back. Can he finish this? Strong hand on that one. Gakia. Really good, strong tackle. And it'll be a throw-in. Well, a good tackle. Chances on. Fifteen minutes left for play. Watford sloppy in possession here. Well, as you can see, he has to get rid of that quicker. That's a poor mistake from the keeper. Goals and plentiful supply, 4-1 currently. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle, and the referee has got to book him, I think. And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there. Tom Lowry and Watford with the ball again Ryan Porteous Pollock Kone so almost at full time and the home side very much in command Stuart what have you made of their overall performance well what an excellent performance this has been They've had complete control for most of the game. Their movement, clever passing and energy have been a joy to watch. It's been a really good win for them. And the danger is averted. Running with the ball confidently. Well, very effective goalkeeping to touch it over. It's a corner. <laughs> Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Over it comes. Well, capable of a better clearance than that. Pretty straightforward defending, dealing with that cross. And really pressing their opponents. And Portsmouth come away with it. Looking for a teammate. And it's come off the keeper. And everyone in the centre looking on as it sailed over them. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Hoot. Kayembe. Jeremy Ngakia. Watford unable to hang on to the ball. 
And now having a go. And still danger here. Well, he put the cross into the right place. And that's it, the final whistle. And the hosts will go through. Well, the result was never in doubt, was it? They controlled the game from start to finish. They created numerous chances and they dictated the tempo. A very comfortable win for them in the end. I don't even know.